It is now time on BBC Radio 1 to play the Noel Gallagher memory game. Oh, that's tense, right? Duncan Middleton music. What? Oh, no, that's right. That's a reference from Greg's show. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Is that what it is? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Duncan, Milton, Duncan. I have no idea what you're talking okay. about. Okay. So, uh, let's play the Noel Gallagher memory game. So I'll play these now then, yeah? Yeah, yeah you will do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Our Hi, first Bill. contestant is Mr. Noel Gallagher. <laughs> right. Good evening. Uh, how are you today? Sensational. Uh, good. Uh, are you doing anything later? What's up? Uh, are you there? Fans distracting you? What? Yeah, I don't like headphones. Um, I'll be doing a rock and roll concert at Wembley Stadium. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. Who are you supporting? Uh, we're supporting the Teenage Cancer Trust. Oh, and, back to the, and back the bid. <laughs> <laughs> very good. <laughs> <laughs> There's your answer. <laughs> All right, let's play the Noel Gallagher memory game. Noel, when you were last on the show in the studio with us. You talked about uh, the time you did your own radio show that was produced by our very own Rachel. The best radio show ever on Radio 1. But which one of the following words did you use to describe Rachel? <laughs> Bearing in mind this is when you were drunk. Okay. Yeah. All right. Is it A, annoying, <laughs> B, quite average really, or C, brilliant? Mm. I'm going to go with, and I don't mean this personally, but I'm going to go with B, <laughs> Quite average, right. really. <laughs> Let's find out if you're right. <laughs> I think I'm saying the is that right. your is that your last uh, answer? Uh, no, sure? no, 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 no. <laughs> I think I may actually, on reflection, have said brilliant. <laughs> Where is it, Rachel? Let's I find it. out. I've lost it... the page now. Just tell me which Five. one it is. Five. Okay, right. <laughs> when I done my own radio, <laughs> Rachel was brilliant. There you go. There you go. Oh, I've sold one out of one. Yeah. Let's just <laughs> let's just hear that slur f uh, one more time. <laughs> when I done my own radio, <laughs> when I done Great my own brilliant radio show, <laughs> brilliant by the way. <laughs> Question number two: You're on the show to give us the world exclusive first play of the single, "The Shock of the Lightning." Dear, oh dear. No but how many it. minutes did you say it took you to write that track? Is it A five, B ten, or C twenty? Ten. B. Ten. Final answer. Took me ten minutes. Yes, like that. it took me <laughs> ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it did actually take Stop me ten me minutes. Ten minutes. No wonder it never got to number one if I was giving you the world <laughs> exclusive on it. Question number three. Noel Gallagher, you tell us a lot about your likes and dislikes in the world at that time, but which person did you say that you love? Was well, it David Beckham, Cristiano Ronaldo, or Paris Hilton? David Beckham. I love David Beckham. There you go. Doing well so far for someone who can't remember being here last time. In the same discussion about your likes and dislikes from the world of popular culture, what did you that you miss? Brilliant. Well, did he write that? <laughs> what I did wrote you, it. What did you that you miss? What did you say? What did you say that you missed? I don't. Don't look at me. I didn't write it. What did he say that you missed out the following? Wellard from EastEnders. Former Manchester City manager Brian Horton. Or Top of the Pops? Oh, easy. I mean, I would have said Jevon from um, Only Fields and Horses, but I'm going to say Top of the Pops. I miss Top of the Pops. <laughs> this is very good. I'm liking this game. Mm. Oh, this is Top of the Pops. <laughs> Moving on to people and places. Now. I sound like I've smoked a lot of cigarettes there. I think you had. Mm. Which group of people did you describe as <laughs> being not a race and instead just a collection of idiots? <laughs> <laughs> what group of people oh. did you describe as oh. being not a race and instead just Let's a just have a look at the album sales. Have Let's just have a look at the album sales yeah. here and see where it didn't really take off. Is it A, the Welsh? Oh. Is it B, Scousers? Oh. Or is it C, the people of Yorkshire? See, that's a tough one because <laughs> really it could, could apply, have been could have been to all of them, really, could it? But I'm going to say, as I've got Yorkshiremen in the room, I would have probably been trying to antagonise you by saying the Yonners, the Yorkshire lads. Yorkshire, Yorkshire people are not a race. I'm right. You're a collective of idiots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good lord. Oh, it was a very funny interview. I'm going to have to... Can somebody get me that? That sounds, that sounds oh, like the kind of thing hilarious. I'm going to play it. <laughs> You're a collective <laughs> of idiots. <laughs> 
Do you know, you know... Do you know, you... incidentally, we didn't play Yorkshire on this tour. I wonder why. <laughs> <laughs> uh, question number six. Inquisitive as always, Noel, to find out what's going on in the hit parade, about which artist did you ask what happened to them? <laughs> Is it A, <laughs> Vanilla Rice, B, MC Hammer, or C, Chakademas and Pliers? Oh, uh, I reckon... Because I'm quite obsessed with the name, <laughs> Chakadema and Pliers. What happened to MC Hammer? <laughs> oh! <laughs> but it's nice to see you fessed up about your love of Chakadema and pl Pliers. Mm. Yes, <laughs> Pliers. What happened to Pliers? <laughs> He's gone solo. What, as, as, <laughs> as opposed to what happened to Chakadema? Yeah. What did happen to Chakadema? Uh, Chakadema, I need a quick five minutes for you. What's up? <laughs> I'm going to go in solo. <laughs> oh, come on, man. What about Chakadema and Pliers? <laughs> Nah, man, I'm just on, going, <laughs> going on my own as pliers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, man. Put the tickets up for the gig now. <laughs> right, question number seven. I'm loving this. In the world of confectionery, which chocolate bar did you describe as what a snack, what a snack? <laughs> <laughs> Is it A, Whisper, B, Star Bar, or C, Kit Kat? Oh, I don't think it would be Kit Kat. <laughs> 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 what a snack. What a snack. That's right. No, you have to deliver it properly. What a snack. What a snack. <laughs> uh, Whisper Star Bar or Kit Kat. This is from the drunk Noel Gallagher and Fuse. This, is, this is a difficult one. I'm going to go... See, I like them all. Star Bars are colossal. <laughs> if anyone's listening there. From, <laughs> um, I'm going to go for the Star Bar... Right. Question seven, answer seven. The star bar. Yes. What a snack. What a snack. <laughs> <laughs> Did all that go out live? Yeah, yeah. Like that. yeah. Brilliant. You never said one, you never swore, you weren't, but, but your mind was just racing. <laughs> um, is there, in fact, yes, okay, there's a question coming. Question number eight. On the subject of Mark Ronson, no, I must apologise. I've never met Mark. <laughs> no, I've I never don't. met Mark. <laughs> apologise in a minute. Right, OK. <laughs> <laughs> On the subject of Mark Ronson, did you say, both Liam and myself are big fans of his work. <laughs> I love what he did with his reworking of Valerie by the Zootons. <laughs> or C, he, did murder it, he wants to write his own tunes rather than ruining everyone else's. Uh -oh. I'm, I'm going to say... It probably could have been two, but it was probably three. Well, in fact, I know it was three. He wants to write his own tunes instead of ruining everybody else's. There you go. <laughs> I know, I didn't, I, I can't, oh yeah. Well, anyway, listen, if you're, if you're listening, Mark Ronson, which you're probably not, you're probably DJing somewhere. I didn't mean any of that, it's very drunk. I'll, I'll pass that on for you. Question number nine. When you were last on the year, you were talking passionately about the album Dig Out Your Soul. But how did you describe it exactly? <laughs> did you say... Of all the albums we've made, this is the one I'm most proud of. Or did he say, of all the albums we've made, this is without doubt the best. Or did he say, of all the albums we've made, this is the most recent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go for C. <laughs> of all the albums we've made, this is the most recent. <laughs> <laughs> And then finally, here's the last question. And I've only got one wrong, haven't I? Yeah, you've yeah. done very well. Yeah. But you've also learnt a lot. <laughs> yeah. Do I get a cake for this? Do I yeah, get a cake for this? Yeah. Do you know what? I think it's probably still in. Your last one probably put it in the freezer <laughs> a year ago. You can go yeah. and ask them a day. Yeah. yeah. Finally, Noel Gallagher, what did you describe as the funniest thing in the world? Is you it... don't even have to give me this because I tell you what the funniest thing in the world is <laughs> is a dog in a hat in a car with sunglasses on. <laughs> That is the funniest thing in the world. You said? Is there anything funnier, right, <laughs> than a dog going down the high street with his face out the... Uh, you know, like when you see dogs in the passenger seat, <laughs> right, and some, someone's wound down the window, and the dogs have got the face out the window, and it's like, whoa, the camera, I'm going 43 miles an hour, and they've got the tongue out. <laughs> the second funniest thing, dogs in hats. <laughs> is there anything funnier than a dog in a hat? Is, you know, hey. I'm not on it. Yeah, I'll put this out. Is there anything funnier than a dog in sunglasses? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. Nothing. What? That's Nothing. what we did. We did that for an hour. A dog in a hat in sunglasses. Mm. Oh, you you know, they should have that at Glastonbury. Yeah. That's a seminal Glastonbury moment. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was the Noel Gallagher memory game with uh, Noel Gallagher, written by Comedy Dave. <laughs>
Copyright, David Management, 2009. <laughs>